With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. A glass prism, prism with a refractive refracting angle of 60 degrees has a refractive index 1.52 for red and 1.6 for violet light. A parallel beam of white is incident on the one face at an angle of incident which gives minimum deviation for red light. Therefore, find the angle of incidence at the prism. So the question is asking us to find out the angle of incidence at the prism if the minimum deviation is for red light. As you can see in this diagram, if we apply geometry and we find out the angle theta, we can clearly see that 60 degrees plus angle theta should be equals to 180 degrees. Therefore, this implies that theta is equals to 120 degrees. And as you can see that this is also a triangle, therefore twice of r plus theta must be equals to 180 degrees. Therefore, this implies that R is equals to 30 degrees. Now, applying Snell's law at this point for red light, we can write that 1 into sin i, where 1 is the refractive index of air and sin i, where i is the angle of incidence, is equals to 1.52, as you can see in the question, that 1.52 is the refractive index for red light multiplied by sine 30 degrees. As you can see that angle R is 30 degrees. Therefore, on calculating this, we find out that sine I is equals to 0 0.76. And as it is given in the question that sine 50 degrees is equals to 0 0.76 Therefore, from this, we can clearly see that I is equals to 50 degrees. Therefore, on this explanation, we can say that the answer is option C. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.